Hello Internet, welcome back to the last lesson of Bootstrap. Uh, in this lesson, I am going to do the carousel component. Uh, carousel is a slider, you can create a simple image slider. Uh, so, before that, uh, I think I did a small mistake uh, last lesson, which was I created the model, mm -hmm. and in the models, I said that we can make it make this model a larger window and a smaller window if you want uh, and I did added the class to this which is wrong as you can see it has gone it has it has slided back to this I mean back to the slider to the right uh, this is not what we want we want it to come down right in the middle uh, so actually you have to add that this class not to this div actually to the model dialog div and save and as you can see it pops up nice right in the middle and of course the sim as well small okay so in this lesson uh, we are going to do carousel so let me play shell tag at the bottom and at the top so and let's create the carousel okay mm, the carousel has uh, as you know the image in the image slices there are buttons at the end this round buttons so that uh, uh, indicators actually these are called indicators that you can traverse the gallery uh, so first we had to create that so we need a div with a class carousel slide and of course you to give it a data right off carousel and of course an id let's say image slide and of course for the indicators we need an order list with the class of carousel indicators carousel indicators okay and there list items with the data target to the id right here image slider we want to give it to point to data slide to first element in zero and the first one is also the active one so give it the active class and let's copy this few times three times actually we have three I have three images I want this to slide to the first element and second element first second and third remove these classes with the first one is the active one and that's it for the indicators next next we add the items image items so carousel in the div with the class of carousel in and we have items inside that we have the images class of item and let's add the image image source I have some images in images slide one and give it a alt of image one okay let's copy this few times this as the image two and image three okay and of course we have to make the first item active because it shows when the page loads 
Okay, let's take a look. There you go. Oopsie doopsie, the issue is I have low resolution images, so let's make the characters smaller. Give it a class of sorry. Give it a class of call LG6 and check it out. There you go. And let's make it a give it a offset of six so that this will come down. Call LG offset by six. There you go. So here's our gallery. Okay. And now the last thing we have to do is we have to we can add arrows so that for the next and the previous were images. So to do that, let's create some anchor tags. Get the href of the ID of the carousel. Come down, hashtag and class of left carousel control and data slide to the previous element so prev and I'm going to give it a span the class of glyph icon glyph icon glyph Chevron, Chevron left. Okay, let's copy this again and paste it. I want this to be the right and to the next slide to the next element, and I want Chevron right. Okay, fresh. There you go. Easy as you like. The uh, gallery, a carousel actually, this is called the carousel component. And there you go. Okay. And next, what we can do, oh, we can add captions to these images as well, the image gallery. To do this, let's go to the item and give it a div of class carousel caption. Carousel caption caption and let's give it a h file tag caption title and of course paragraph description. Copy this few times. go and you will see caption title description I think this needs to have a class nope let's make this bigger so you can see there you go actually the images are too small for this but that's it actually you can create a simple carousel using bootstrap it doesn't take five minutes okay then um, I hope you guys enjoyed the lesson series and please subscribe to the channel give your comments I, li I like to hear your feedback and stay tuned for more lessons on more other frameworks may especially in year two and other languages as well so thank you for watching have a good day bye take care